same question every week. How's your job? Are you having any negative thoughts? Oh, I have a negative thought. I really love the performance because this is a character that I've seen before, but I've never seen him like that. For you, was it important that you take on, you know, a script where technically you could give your own new action to him? It was it was important to have the freedom to try to discover something that felt like it was a new take. And obviously, there have been great performances in films um, with Joker in them, but we just felt like we don't we want to make a, a different movie, um, and so it was, it was important just to have that kind of freedom. And something that it's important to talk from the beginning. He'd written the script that felt like it was completely unique and like something I'd never read before. Um, but so, yeah, what was it was important. Finally, one laughed at me. Well, no one's laughing now. You can say that again, pal. Now, are we talking about a certain type of body language and physicality that was important for you to take on for the role? Because not only of who he is and how skinny he is, but also the, the spaces that he's in, you know, the elevator and the staircases. Yeah, it was a real opportunity to, to show these, um, this transformation from Arthur the Joker and the body language of Arthur, somebody that's wound tight and feels inadequate and insecure, and Joker who feels like somebody that's is completely comfortable in their skin. Um, and so it was just really important, I thought, to, sh to see those two sides of the character. How did you feel the first time you saw Gotham City? I mean, uh, how was it for you, those types of sets? I'd be so excited to see Gotham City. Yeah, it was New York. <laughs> like, a couple of things. Very excited to be in New York. Um, no, they were brilliant. Um, I mean, right here, just to go through that staircase, um, there were amazing uh, locations that we had, and the, the sets that, that uh, Mark had built were just astonishing. And obviously, it's a really big part of the performance and all the work that you do. You are, you are reacting to the environment. Um, and so there was just, you, you, you actually could feel the locations and the sets. I think this is funny. What, what was your uh, relation to uh, comics when you were younger, and are you able to gauge why audiences are so fascinated by them and, and keep being so fascinated by those characters? Um, I actually collected when I was younger. Um, I, I, I don't know. What, uh, I, I would not answer that. That's why it's, it's a good answer to say you collected them. You yeah. love them. <laughs> Uh, uh, award buzz already, you know, everybody saw it in Kenya yesterday and came out and said Oscars. <laughs> is it because it, it makes you overwhelmed or, or, or is it because it's not important when the role is good? When a role is so good, no, is it important? Next <laughs> My next question was about showing this to an international audience and, and just gauging their reaction by being in the room. How is it for you? Well, I came in for the last 10 minutes last night for screening, so I wasn't there for the whole, the whole screening. Um, and to be perfectly honest, it's very uncomfortable to, to be, uh, for me to be, to, to, to be in the theater with, with people watching it. I don't think I can watch in the way that you could, right? I have two things, I have every take I go, ah, oh, I, I wish that would have been a little bit different. And so it's, it's not really enjoyable for me. It was enjoyable for us. It uh, was the perfect performance. You. Congratulations. One small thing. Yeah. When you bring me out, can you introduce me as Joker? <laughs> <laughs>